The Lancashire chase is next. It's the first Grade 1 event of the week, I think. Area Elliott at the top four. David Robertson, San Pedro Cartel and San Pedro Paddy. Well, Vinnie Gerard, the tree man, Joshua Sutherland, there on time, David Hooley. Wooden ship there on Martin Resberg. Agnetta's Eagle, Graham Clutterbuck, Balladiera Ivor, David Robertson, Briarwood Lady Jim Murray, New Year's Day, Martin Lidham, Nightclub at Craig Beckwith, Plava Laguna, Padraig Hogan, Secret Passageway, Leon Van Rensburg, The Widow, Joshua Sutherland, Violets No Weighty, Alex Cherry and Zara Cover for Darren Thompson. 16 this time, big feel for Group 1. Grade 1 and away they go. And Briarwood Lady in the lead then, passing the winning post with two complete circuits of the track to go. Pretty sure that when they rejigged all the boundaries not so long ago again, they do it quite regularly in these bigger places, that I don't think Haydock is technically in Lancashire anymore. This is the Lancashire Tower. I think Haydock is now in Merseyside, but I might be wrong on that. The chick. It definitely used to be in Lancashire, because well, Liverpool used to be in Lancashire as well once. But anyway, Broad Ladies in the lead. The Tree Man is second. And then Balladier Iris is third. Plava Laguna fourth. And then New Year's Day, San Pedro Cartel after that one. Oh, cricket, Warwickshire's Cricket Ground is in Birmingham, which isn't in Warwickshire. Anyway, they're all over that one. It's in the West Midlands. So they've made that up in the 70s as they get over the second. Safely over the second. And that's this week's quiz question. Is Haydock Park still technically in Lancashire or is it now in Merseyside? They get two to third. And they're all safely over that one. And the tree man in second. And then New Year's Day third. Right, Brian Ward Lady for Jim Murray is well clear at the moment to get over number four. Good almost take on the inside by Plava Laguna in the yellow. Wooden ship for Leon Van Rensburg is just a back marker at this stage as they get to this ditch. And also for the over the ditch all jumped it well. Yeah, Brian Ward Lady in front still the only grey in this field for Jim Murray. Leading by a good five lengths to Zara cover in second. And the Joshua Sutherland pair, the tree man and the widow. Together with Nightclub on the outside. Nightclub is usually out in the back. He's not normally as handy as this. Uh, looking for a big run from him today. Then comes Plava Laguna, who's recovered from that mistake and is now joining that little group who are disputing second. San Pedro Paddy just heads the other group as they get to the sixth. Looks like they all got over okay. One or two nodded on landing, didn't jump in all that. Well, what have they got? Points if it was a jumping competition, they get over the next. And San Pedro Cartel has now dropped to the back with a leader. The grey Briarwood lady seems to be going well within herself at the moment. Missing off the ground, heading in towards the next one. Oh, she stood off that one. I thought I'd give her the kiss of death then for a minute because that animation looks like it's the one where the horse just crumples and the jockey falls out the side. They get into the next one. And they're all over that one okay. And Briarwood Lady almost joined by the tree man. Plava Laguna is the one who's moved up into third. Then comes Zara Cover and the Widow with San Pedro Paddy on the outside. Violet's no waiting. Buddy Air either. are also getting closer. Nightclub is now in mid div, but he's still a lot handier than normal. Then comes three there on time and secret passageways after that one. And towards the back New Year's Day is now dropping towards the rear. Old lady is in the lead and clearing the lead as well by four lengths to the tree man and San Pedro Paddy with Plava Laguna and the widow between them. Violet's no weighty grouping up the inside and it's making some good ground now as well as wooden ship secret passageway also getting a bit closer as they head to the next. This is number 10. And what was a fall there? San Pedro Cartel's gone. So San Pedro Cartel from Vinnie Gerard goes at the back. They get into number 11, which they all jumps okay. And Vinnie Gerard's other San Pedro, San Pedro Paddy.
going through to take a share of the lead there, but now Nightclub has gone. This is very early for Nightclub to be getting into the lead. Wooden Ship's gone right through for the back there. Now Wooden Ship tries to take it off, but Brywood Lady's having none of it, and she's gone back into the lead. So it's Brywood Lady on the inside. Wooden Ship in second. Nightclub in third. The Widow is four. Then comes San Pedro Paddy. Bun of the Air River is next. Then New Year's Day is now starting a bit of a forward move. Zara covers after that one. Then Arian Elliott as they get over to the 13th. A mistake at the back by Secret's Passageway. They're on time. Plava Laguna and Agnetta Eagle look as though they might well be out of it as they come to the next. This is the last ditch, I think, the 14th. And now Wooden Ships jump back into the lead. It's Wooden Ship who's gone on from Brywood Lady in second. Nightclubber is third. Then Bala the Air Arriver. New Year's Day coming around the outside. Then comes the Widow and the Tree Man. Zara Cover is trying to get into it as well. They swear to the straight. They've still got a long way to go. They've still got four and a half furlongs and four flight fences to get over. And Brywood Lady is battling back into the lead on the inside of Wooden Ship in second. Balladier Arriver is third. New Year's Day is four. Then comes the Tree Man and the Widow. Zara Cover is after that one. Nightclubber is after that. Just dropping back a little bit. San Pedro Paddy still trying to get into it. Over the 15th they go. Just three more to take. And Balladier Arriver is now taking it up. Balladier Arriver from Briarwood Lady. Wooden Ship between the two of them. Over the final. Oh, he's gone! Balladier Arriver's down at the third last. And it's Briarwood Lady who's gone back into the lead. Wooden Ship is second. Then New Year's Day the Tree Man, the Widow and Nightclubber is between these as they race down towards the final two furlongs and the final two fences over the second last and it's now Wooden Ship and Brianwood Lady New Year's Day on the outside is third then comes the Nightclub on the outside the Widow and the Tree Man are still there as well this is the final fence and it's Wooden Ship who landed in the lead and Wooden Ship is starting to pull away now Wooden Ship for Leo Van Rensburg is clearing the lead and he's racing inside the final half furlong with a four or a five length advantage and Wooden Ship takes the Lancashire chase it's going to be very close for second Nightclub a second the Tree Man the Widow then Brian Wood Lady Secret Passageway finished well as well we lost a couple in the straight Plava Laguna and Violet's No Weighty as well as that Balladier Arriver who crashed out when challenging for the lead but it's Wooden Ship back to form really after a couple of bad runs earlier in the season takes that grade one race for Leon Van Rensburg Nightclub was second for Craig Beckwith back to form for that one as well the tree man Joshua Sutherland third the widow Joshua Sutherland fourth and New Year's Day was fifth